like zero o'clock in the morning. I'm just kidding. It's like 1051. It's okay. It's like zero o'clock in the morning. You'll have to bear with me. I have fans going because it's warm in my apartment. I have uh, the camera set to this mode where it zooms in on my face. I think it's kind of entertaining. You guys tell me if it's not entertaining. And uh, I'm going to record some of this lovely, lovely game called Getting Over It. Because Cuphead wasn't infuriating enough. No, I had to take it a step further and infuriate myself, you know, in even larger amounts. So let me tell it I want the mouse. It's loud in my ears, but I bet it's not always loud in my ears. Okay. Oh. Game. I don't know how this game controls, and I don't... I'm not excited to learn how it controls. I'm not excited about this at all. I just, this is gonna be... Oh, no. Oh, we don't love this. Oh, it's, it's worse than it looks. It really is. It's even worse than it looks. This is horrendous. Like, you watch people play this, and you go, Ah, oh, I could do that. I could do that. Nope. It's bad. <clears throat> it's gonna take me, like, so long just to learn how to get up over this tree. I need, I need more space for this mouse is what I need. My mouse needs all the space in the world because. Can we like? Okay. Can I like? Oh god! How do YouTubers do this? Wait. Nope. Uh, yeah. mm. Careful. Careful. There we go. Can we go over the? Oh. Over the tree. Over the. Oh my ah. god! This is horrible. Can I like? hear water. It's, it's a soothing sound, which is funny because this is not a soothing game. This is awful. Can I turn up my mouse like having the, oh my god, this is horrible. Because see, I have my like, okay, cool. when does the guy start talking mm. to me? Doesn't that There's no happen? feeling more there intense than starting over. If you deleted your homework the day before it was due, as I have, or if you left your wallet at home, and you have to go back after spending an hour in the commute. If you won some money at the casino, and then put all your winnings on red, but it came up black. If you got your best shirt dry cleaned before a wedding, and then immediately dropped food on it. If you won an argument with a friend, and then later discovered that they just returned to their original view. Starting over is harder than starting up. If you're not ready for that, like if you've already had a bad day, then what you're about to go through might be too much. Feel free to go away and come back. I'll be here. Okay, guy. I'll, okay. I'll go away and come back. I won't. All right. Really Thanks for coming with me on this trip. <clears throat> I'll understand if you have to take a break at any point. Thanks, dude. Just find a safe place to stop and quit the oh. game. Okay. Don't worry. Okay. I'll save your progress always, even your mistakes. Oh, thanks, buddy. Oh. Oh, oh, yep, this yep, game yep, is a homage yep. to a free game that came out in 2002, titled Sexy Hiking. The author of that game was Jazuo, a mysterious Czech designer who was known at the time as the father of B games. And B games are rough assemblages of found objects. Designers slap them together very quickly and freely, and they're often too rough and unfriendly to gain much of a following. They're built more for the joy of building them than as polished products. I think you all should know that my, my Steam says I'm playing this game right now, and that a, a friend I haven't talked to in a while, because, you know, Steam will show other people what you're playing, and a friend I haven't talked to in a while just messaged me, don't mess up. And, you know, I, I kind of just, I want to answer and be like, uh, it's, it's a little late for that, buddy. I'm recording this for my work, for my place of employment. They want to see me... Wait, uh, yeah, do you guys want to see me fail at this game? Because, I don't know, I enjoy watching people play. In a certain way, Sexy Hiking is the perfect embodiment of a B game. It's built almost entirely out of found and recycled parts. And it's one of the most unusual and unfriendly games of its time. In it, your task is simply to drag yourself up a mountain with a hammer. And that act of climbing, in the digital world or in real life, has certain essential properties that give the game its flavor. No amount of forward progress is guaranteed. Some cliffs are too sheer or too slippery. And the player is constantly, unremittingly in danger of falling and losing everything. Oh. Oh, 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 there we go. I think you guys will find that I'm kind of a... I'm kind of a, like, afterwards panicker, so I'll fall and I'll be like, well, that sucked, and then I'll get 
to the point where I'm like, I can't believe that happened, like, but, like, ten minutes later. It's, I don't panic immediately, I panic afterwards. <clears throat> why? 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 Why is my life like this? I, I don't know <clears throat> if I'll ever actually... Yeah. I just want to <clears throat> go... Okay. Oh, oh. Let me try. climbing the same spot, but like, all evening. Even though I said it was zero o'clock in the morning, it's just gonna be all, Whoop. the whole time that I'm existing, climbing the same <clears throat> spot. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Whoop, okay, I made it up there. The controls really are awful. If you guys haven't tried this game before, I have to recommend that you, that you try Whoop. just the, just the controls, because the controls are just absolutely horrendous. <clears throat> Please don't go back. Whoop. Down the mountain, please, please. It's just this dude in this like pot with this hammer, and I hate this so much. Yeah, I, I hate this. I hate this a lot, and I knew I would hate it, but I don't think I understood quite the extent that my hate was going to be. Like I, uh, I don't think anyone can understand until they feel these controls exactly how much they're gonna hate this game. No, what, dip, no. Okay, are we just... Okay, neat. I love that. Thanks. Thanks, guy. Why is this guy with his hammer climbing this mountain anyways? Like, does he need some help? Can we help get him off the mountain? I suppose that's what we're trying to do. What? And it's such a weird mountain of stuff, too. Like, why is there so much stuff up here? It's like an old car. Like, why is there so many just things? Why is there no regular music that's- Oh, my wrist is starting to hurt from moving the mouse around so much. Whoop. Mm. Okay, cool. Mm. Wait, 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 nope, nope, alright, neat. Wait, aha, 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 Okay, oh, no, 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 no. This isn't gonna be good. Okay, wait. What if I just... What if I just... Just settle this down, like, right there. Right? And then we could... Pick the... Okay, I don't think that's gonna work. I think we're gonna have to move this... This puppy around. Oh, mm. what? Yeah, nope. Well, uh, nope. Oh. What if we... Oh, okay. Cool. Thanks. That was neat. That was, that was super Whoop. cool. Oh, okay. Whoop. Seems like there are spots that'll catch you so that you never fall all the way back down, but I assure you guys, if you haven't seen this game before, you absolutely can fall all the way back down. It's great. Mm. It's lovely. Oh. Wait, but uh, 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 cool. Mm. Please throw me the right direction, my dude. My good dude. Anyway, when you start sexy hiking, oh. you're standing next to this dead tree that blocks the way to the entire rest of the game. It might take you an hour to get over that tree, and a lot of people never got past it. You prod and you poke at it, exploring the limits of your reach and your strength, trying to find a way up and over. And there's a sense of truth in that lack of compromise. Most obstacles in video game worlds are fake. You can be completely confident in your ability to get through them, once you have the correct method, or the correct equipment, or just by spending enough time. In that sense, every pixelated obstacle in sexy hiking is real. I forgot about the fact that he talks about another game all throughout the first part of th this game. Which is fine, I guess. That's cool. The obstacles in sexy hiking are unyielding, and that makes the game uniquely frustrating. But I'm not sure Jazuo intended to make a frustrating game. 
The frustration is just essential to the act of climbing, and it's authentic to the process of building a game about climbing. A funny thing happened to me as I was building this mountain. I'd have an idea for a new obstacle, and I'd build it, test it, and it would usually turn out to be unreasonably hard. But I couldn't bring myself to make it easier. It already felt like my inability to get past the new obstacle was my fault as a player rather than as a builder. Imaginary mountains build themselves from our efforts to climb them. And it's our repeated attempts to reach the summit that turns those mountains into something real. Okay. I, I, he just... When you're building a video game world, oh, no. you're building with ideas. And that can be like working with quickset yeah. cement. You mold your ideas into a certain shape that can be played with. And in the process of playing with them, they begin to harden and set until they're immutable, like rock. And at that point, you can't change the world. Not without breaking it into pieces and starting fresh with new ideas. Can we just... Can we just... Oh, no, not that way. How do I... Oh, oh, cool. That's neat. I love that. That's awesome. Thanks. Okay, I'll just... I'll just carefully go over here and then I'll... Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll do that. That sounds great. God, I was about to make a reference that none of you guys would get. Because I forget that I'm... Old. So, uh, it just makes me want to just quit while I'm ahead. Like, I've gotten, what, 11 minutes into this thing, and I just want to, I just want to stop because I feel like I'm really ahead, you know, like. Oh my god, okay. Whoop. Oh. Bop. Bop. No, you grab onto that steel beam, buddy. You hold on to it, and you let me mm. up here. Oh, no, 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 no. Hold on to the steel beam. Okay. And you let me eat you up here. Come on. You've got, no, you've got this. There you go, dude. And then you're gonna eat up here, and you're gonna, oh, okay. Oh, well, we, we would have had it. We would have had it. I don't remember how to, like, oh, no, oh, no. Where are you going, dude? Dude, in the... Dude in the pot, where are you going? What you doing? In the cauldron? Where are you? Okay. The controls for this are so infinitely frustrating. Like, infinitely frustrating. Like, not just frustrating, but like, it like hurts my soul. I'm like, tense in my entire, oh, well thanks. In my entire body. My whole body is tense. Trying to play this game. I feel like oh. I feel like I should like like drink some chamomile tea. Oh no, you're not. Uh, oh no, you're, I know what this is. I know what. The, oh. Oh, you uh. just lost a lot of progress. That's mm. a deep frustration. A real punch in the gut. Uh, uh, well, you know what? We may as well just go all the way back to the beginning. Just, just let's get us backwards. Can we just go back over this thing? We may as well just go all the way back to the tree at the very beginning of the game because that's pretty much where we're at at this point. And, and you know, that's fine. That's fine. I don't mind losing literally all my, all my progress all at the same time. This is fine. We're fine. This is, this is all going great. No. Did the guy just talk? said no, right? Like, I heard that right, right? Oh, good, no. Oh, no, that's not gonna work. You gotta, you gotta shuffle it back this way a little bit. If I had that kind of upper arm strength, I would be very impressed with myself. Like, the guy is, like, mocking me at this point, right? Sorry about that. Yeah, he's, he's mocking me. Does he just do that? Is that just his existence to mock me? I don't feel like that's fair. Oh, oh well. Mm. Nope. No. It, uh, is he gonna keep mocking me? Is that this guy's lot in life? It's just he made a game just to mock people who play his game that he made. Oh, this is so infinitely frustrating. I can see why people have like thrown chairs over this game because I kind of want to throw my chair right now. I kind of want to pick up my chair and just yeet it into the lake. Mm. Like, I, can, I can find a 
you chair mm. out like that. This is a real thing that's happening. Deep breaths. I can do this. I have got this. I can play this game without getting angry. I can. There we go. See, I totally told you. I can play this game without getting angry. I can get really good at the controls. I'll get good at this game. That's what I do. I'll become a master at this game. I will beat anyone at this game. This will be my game of choice for the rest of my life. I just gotta be real careful. And then, yes, yes, and then we go we do it again. We're just gonna, we're just gonna put the hammer here. And... And lift off. And then we're gonna go. Oh. 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 The guy is mocking me again. Y'all can hear that, right? Oh. Like he. Mm. Mm. Like I don't know if it's the guy in the cauldron thing who's mocking me, or if it's the oh. narrator guy. Someone. I don't even know how I got it this the first time. Oh. Someone is mocking me. Oh. It might be the guy in the cauldron. The guy in the culture is going to be mocking me. Whoop. Am I getting a headache from this game? Maybe a little. Whoop. Nope, not that bit. You gotta, you gotta, uh, 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 okay. If we go on the other side of this rock, we basically fall back to the beginning of the game. So let's, like, not do that if we can help it. So I made it back up. So that was the very frustrating task of watching me make it all the way back up, which I'm not gonna cut out. Y'all gotta sit and watch through this with me. If I gotta, uh, if I gotta suffer through, y'all gotta suffer through. Wait, I can't reach the, uh, there's a light. And if I could get to that light, I think I can like, uh, oh, oh, okay. I wonder why there's still water in the cauldron after all this time. Like, I think eventually all of the water would have gone out of the cauldron. Would not be in it anymore. I don't know if that's even what that's officially called. It just looked kind of like a big pot to me. And I'm betting it's a cauldron. Like, oh, 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 cool. That was neat. Didn't y'all love that? You've done this part list? before. You know it's possible. Just do what you did the first time. Thanks, narrator guy. How does he know that I've only ever gotten up to like this part of this part? Like. Done this part before. Come on, narrator dude. Eh. Done this part before, not really. Wait, I have an idea. I have an idea. I have an idea. Okay. If I pull myself up like this, and I put the cauldron down right here on this rock, and I yeet up. Oh, yep, yep, yep. Okay, we won't do it again. I'm gonna just yeet. But faster this time, like an actual yeet. Gonna go eat. We were so close. I was so close. Why is the camera so close? Back up, back up off my face, camera. I just want. I just, I just want to go up. I just, wait, I think I see a spot. Maybe I could like. Oh, uh, uh, well, this is cool. This, this is cool. I'm like gonna hurt my wrist trying to control the mouse well enough to play this game. This game is not like it's it's fun, but like, is it really? You know, like this this is just torture. Ah, oh, oh, cool. I feel like there's only so much I can just lose all my progress, you know, before I just absolutely lose it, and then probably throw a chair across the room or something. turning my head to try to get the better, like, position, or, well, at what point do I just get to be done? Like, at what point do I just get to be like, you know, I'm never gonna touch this game again? Whoop. At what point do 
I just, do I just go home, you know? <clears throat> oh my god, oh, okay, okay, so that's really what I need to do, I need to reach for that spot there, okay. This is probably one of the more frustrating things that I personally have ever experienced in my entire life. Um, which is really saying a lot because, you know, <clears throat> life be such a way that it can get really frustrating. Like, life itself is a frustrating experience, but sometimes. But this is a whole new level of, like, horrific. And I do mean horrific. Like, this is horrible. Nope. Okay. Okay. If I can get on that and catch that light right there, I can pull up and then around onto the other. Uh, yep. Nope, up, up. You know, we did try. I really wish that this wasn't a hammer. I wish that this was like a, literally any other implement, honestly. Like, you could replace this with like an axe or like literally pretty much any other. It, place this with almost any other implement or tool and you would be better off like like it being a hammer there's no grip there you know it just falls so much cool thanks I'm like squirming in my chair trying to like shift the weight of this dude's cauldron which is not gonna happen okay wait Wait, 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 wait. Okay. So I need to just... I need to just... Uh, this is like one of the more frustrating experiences I think I've ever had. In like my entire life. Like it makes me want to just like... Ugh, like it's... Oh, thanks. Okay, cool. Nito. That's that's cool. That's cool. Mm. Nope, that's probably not smart of me. Sometimes if you go fast, it helps. Sometimes if you go fast, it ruins it. So it just depends on it just depends on how it's, you know, how it's hanging. see it won't grip right there because it's a hecking hammer and not like an actual tool that could be used for this purpose. Oh my gosh, this is literally infinitely, ridiculously frustrating. You know what, we're we going to do this the fast way now because... Oh, no, maybe we not, maybe we not, because I can't get him to use this hammer. Robert, oh my god. Can you go up in the car? Okay. Can you just... Can you just... Ah, uh, well, no. I can see why a lot of Let's Plays on YouTube with this game are like... 25-ish minute episodes rather than some of the Let's Players usually do like hour episodes because I couldn't, I couldn't take an hour of this. Like, I kind of want to like scream into the void. Like, I want to screech into the void. This is so ridiculously infinitely frustrating. And I'm, I'm trying to like turn my mouse sensitivity up thinking that's the problem, but I really don't think it is. I think it's just designed to be infinitely, horribly, ridiculously frustrating. And if that was the design he was going for, I mean, dude, how successful can a one guy be? If he was going for frustrating. Boy, he should win some kind of award. He probably did, honestly. Oh my god. I guess in my brain I was thinking there was going to be some kind of mechanism for like clicking and like releasing the like you could grab and hold and you could like click to hold on tight but that's like not a thing you just kind of are just in the world with this hammer and it's ridiculous and stupid oh no well yeah. okay, oh, oh, oh. the physics of 
physics are absolutely not okay. Like, I'm not okay with this. I don't know who told this guy it was okay to make this game, but I think that we should go have a conversation with the guy and be like, I just, I just want to talk. Who told you that this was okay? Like, who told you that it was an okay and good idea to make this game? Because it is neither an okay nor a good idea. Oh, no, but, but. It was a bad idea. Like, it, it, if his goal was to frustrate everyone, then maybe it was a good idea. But who has that goal? Like, who makes a game and goes, you know what? I'm going to make the most infinitely frustrating, awful thing that anyone's ever played. And I'm going to laugh about it. Like, who, who does that, buddy? In fact, you know what? That's... Did, did we get right here? It has been, like, 25 minutes. It won't be when I chop it up. But you know what? It, that, that's it. That's all we got. I will play more of this when my... My temper and my volume level in this apartment while people are sleeping allows me to because I need to scream at this game. I need to yell. I need to throw things, probably. This is absolutely awful. Do I recommend this game? 100%. Please get it. Get the game. Frustrate yourself. I'll probably be back and play more at some point in time. But for now, just have fun with the knowledge that I want to pick up my chair and throw it across the room. Probably through the wall. Like, forget like a window, they're too easy to break. I want to throw the chair so hard that it smashes through the wall and lands on the ground on the other side. <laughs>